Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacob. This lesson will focus on the number one. One of the most basic skills needed by students in kindergarten is number recognition. The meaning of the number one can be simply explained by saying that it represents a single object in real life. And we'd explain very clearly what this means, a single object. Now tracing is a very important skill for kindergarten students because it's a very important fine motor skill. So students are given opportunities to trace the number one and this is just an example of what they could be given and they can give many more examples than this one. It could be a whole sheet. It can be explained to students that the tracing represents the short way of writing the number one. It is the actual number. So that is the actual number and the short way of writing it. We also need to explain that it can be written as a word. So that's also important. So students are given opportunity to trace the word one, O-N-E, something like this, and you can give them many more examples. Naturally, teachers would make students aware of the appropriate font. That's very important. Students are given opportunities to recognize those groups that contain one object. This is just a basic example here, just to give you an idea of what I mean. Circle the box that contains one object. So the students would very carefully look at each box and I'm sure they would circle this one. The next example, circle the boxes. You would tell them that there's more than one answer. Okay, they have to circle more than one box that contain one object. So they'll be looking carefully and they'll be circling that box there and they'll be circling this box here. Students love colouring in. So here's a, a very good little exercise. This is just one example and you can use many other animals or many other objects. You could ask them to colour one fish. Obviously they'd pick any one of those but they only colour one. And we know how much students love drawing, especially young students. So we, you would ask them to draw one cat, one dog, one horse. You can pick any other animal or any other object. But it just gives them the opportunity to recognise the number one and what it stands for in real life. And that's really, really important. 